What is up guys, it's the Redstone side is here, and today I'm going to show you how to build this neat little, cute little contraption that's a flush with the floor furnace array, and when you place an item in, the lights light up and it plays a little tune, and when it is done, it will play a lower note. and the lights will turn off. Each furnace is controlled individually. It's not super practical, but I think it's a really cute design and it fits really well. It's very, very easy to build. You can build it in under a minute if you're good. And so I'm gonna show you how to build it. Let's get started. All right, here's what you're gonna need to build it. You're gonna need four sticky pistons, eight slime blocks, eight blocks of redstone, 16 observers, some wool blocks or whatever you want your redstone blocks to be, 12 redstone dust, eight note blocks, eight redstone lamps, four unmovable blocks to place on the floor, your four furnaces, and some uh, blocks to surround it on the floor. And so we already have set up here the furnaces, and so what we want to do is go down four blocks. So you want to dig down four blocks around it like this, and so that's one, two, three, four, and you're going to grab your observers, like so, and build down three times. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and then you're going to have to dig down to get this last one, but then you want to go three. All right, then you wanna grab your wool and place your blocks uh, right beneath it, like so, one, two, three, four. Next thing you wanna do is you wanna go on the edges, so diagonally across all around, you wanna place a sticky piston, one, two, three, and four. Next thing you wanna do is you wanna grab your redstone dust, and uh, the thing that's controlling each piston is gonna be on the left side, so on every side, you wanna put it on the left, like so. Next side on the left, next side, on the left, and next side on the left. Next thing you want to do is you want to grab your slime blocks and go one, two on each one. One, two, one, two, one, two. Grab your redstone blocks and connect it all up like so. Just connect all of the slime blocks all around like that. Next thing you want to do is you want to go around and you want to place two wool blocks. Again, we're going to be dealing with the left side of each one, so you want to place three like that and break the middle one like so. So, uh, next side, you want to face the left, place three blocks, and break the middle one like so. Place three blocks. Next thing you want to do is you want to grab your observers again, and you want to place it so that it is facing uh, on top of, in between these two blocks, and you want to make it so that the detection side is facing toward the redstone block. So that means that the face is facing to the right, and the output is facing to the left and you want to go ahead and do that on every side. Next, you want to place some redstone on all of the wool blocks here. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, just like that. Now you want to take your note blocks, and right here, you want to place on, again, we're looking on the left side, and so on the right wool block, you want to place one down and hit it four times. So one, two, three, four. Next one you're going to want to place right next to it, up and diagonally over. So up one, over one, like this. And you want to hit this one 16 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We're almost done. The next thing you want to do is you want to place a block on top of the left wool block on each side. So the far left right there, the far left right there, the far left right here, and the far left right here. So it's just on the corners of the build. And then that is it. So you can cover it up with your redstone lamps like so, two on each side. And then on the corners, you want to place four immovable blocks. These can be obsidian or leaves or note blocks or even more furnaces, whatever you want. In my case, it's going to be obsidian. And now it should work perfectly. So you can see that each furnace is individually controlled. Let's place in that. Let's grab some sand to smelt into glass. And we have the ping that it starts, and we have the ping that it's done, just like that. And that is all there is to it. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you want to see more simple survival redstone creations like this, make sure to leave a like and let me know in the comments. Make sure to check out the jam-packed description for more science. I will see you next time, and of course, thanks for watching.